The Minnesota State University Mankato Alumni Association is honored to present Dr. James Connors with the Harold J. Fitterer Service Award. Jim, who has run a successful dental practice in Mankato since 1980, has a long history of service to the university. He's served on an advisory board for the dental hygiene program and provided mouth guards for student athletes. He teaches future athletic trainers about mouth injuries and is the on-call dentist for the sports teams. He was also on the foundation board for nine years, including two as president. It was a very rewarding time to raise money and know that we were providing scholarship money for students and that we were providing research money for uh, undergraduate students, which is almost unheard of. One of the reasons Jim feels so strongly about giving back to the university is because of the experiences he had here. He made lifelong friends as part of the Phi Delta Theta fraternity and met his wife Christine dancing at the Cato Ballroom. They were married in 1968. And there was a recessed courtyard outside the student union, and this is where Chris and I had our wedding reception. Oddly enough, when my daughters got married, they decided that the campus provided a great atmosphere for a reception, so we erected tents next to the clock tower, and both of my daughters were married, and both of them spent their uh, receptions at MSU. Jim stays in contact with many friends from the university, including some of the faculty who made an impact on him. I have fond memories of my advisor, Professor Dean Turner, a wonderful gentleman who I still see today almost every summer. I had a professor of speech, Professor Schnorr. For some reason, he and I really connected, and I always think of him as somebody that took time with his students to talk to him and know who they were. After graduating, Jim spent four years in active duty with the United States Navy, then went to dental school at Georgetown. When he decided to pursue private practice, he and Chris returned to Mankato. Chris and I had always wanted to be in a college town. Not a big city college town, but a college town. And we had fond memories of Mankato. Not long after establishing his practice here, he became an early adopter of the CAD-CAM technology that has helped revolutionize dentistry. It's a technology that allows you to take a picture of a tooth that you want to restore, and then to draw an image of it on a computer screen and then for that to go to a milling device and you can actually mill out the piece that's going to fit the tooth in a very precise manner. I was the only dentist in Minnesota for seven years to embrace this technology. Yet today, digital technology and CAD CAM dentistry is everywhere in dentistry. Last summer, Jim and Chris celebrated their 46th wedding anniversary. Although campus looks quite different than it did on their wedding day, it's still one of their favorite places to visit. Coming to campus is always one of those times when you brighten up. The energy of the students is contagious. 